pack out, lift up when you take off. How you did that? You put switches up by your blinkers. How you did that? Your LV back turned to a legend. How you did that? I seen that back turn to a Louis. How you did that? That look like a brand new booty. How you did that? You got face stones and love a watch. How you did that? You hear some scratches in your closet. Why you did that? How you yell and slash that? How I kill a cat? Yeah, hopping around in a two to make it. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to my channel. So, if you see, I look a little different right now. Nails busted, hair and twists, freshly washed. <sighs> My eyes are red because I literally just hopped out the shower. Like, lips still dry. Oh, I'll shoot my face up. Anyway. <sighs> it's late. It's One o'clock in the morning right now and I decided I'm gonna give myself mini twists. Yeah. If you don't know what mini twist is, I'll put up some pictures, but like it's really good for natural hair and it's supposed to be super cute. I'm scared because first I believe I have 4C hair. I'm not sure what. Some people say I don't, some people say I do. I don't know. But whatever, I have four type hair. And I'm nervous that either they're gonna not look right. I'm gonna look like a little boy. I'm scared. Like I'm nervous, but I really wanna do it. And I decided, why not record my, the process? Record the process. First, I washed my hair and I decided to twist it. So then when it dries a little bit, cause you're supposed to do it damp, it will be like stretched some. I'm also gonna take the blow dryer and like go like that. Also, I have a question, so I had, braids for like two months no I had knotless box braids for like two months and usually before I start using this Shea Bay oil or Shea Bay stuff my hair is like stopped shedding as much like it just shed like a lot like when I took it out but I brushed my hair and everything I've taken it out is this a lot of hair to come out it's way less than I ever had but like is this a lot for two month, two month old braids. I don't know. Comment down below because I really do want to know if I'm like chipping, is my hair falling out? I don't know. Anyway, so the scalp is real clean. Now I'm nervous. I'm like really nervous. <laughs> and this is gonna take forever. Before I start, let me tell y'all what I'm using because I my hair is all natural, but I don't really know how to deal with my hair like I just get braids like I just get box braids I get knotless I get braid styles or if I get a wig I get my hair braided back I put on a wig that's it I don't really actually ever deal with my natural hair I actually prefer to just have it in braids because I don't be knowing what to do with it but I want to get into doing my natural hair and making it cute and liking it because me and my natural hair have had a long journey for sure. But let me show y'all what I'm using because I don't have a lot of stuff in my house. Like I went around my house and collect every piece of hair stuff I could find, okay? Shea Bay Shea Butter. I got this from a girl from TikTok. It's like an infused butter with Shea Bay oil and stuff in it. I've been using this. I'm gonna put that on there just to lock in some more shoe. I don't, I don't know what I'm doing. It's, you guys are coming along with me on this journey. Some other stuff I have is some curl strength pudding with flex seeds um some edge control i may use a different one i don't know some edge controls for the front have my stuff slick back and then um some eco styling gel <laughs> i don't know and lastly i have some mousse what i'm scared about is that my they're gonna come out flat which is what i don't want oops because I do not want them to be flat. I want them to be full and cute. So I can actually style them. If not, I'm not gonna take them out. No, I'm gonna throw a wig on top of them. I'm going to take my blow dryer, stretch them from like the middle and the, the roots in this, but not really my ends. Oh wait, I'm just gonna try and stretch them a little bit before I start. So it's like damp, but not too wet. Yard, 
Okay guys, so I tried to stretch it, didn't really do nothing, so I took it out of the twist, put my shea butter in there to give it some moisture. I'm just going to have it damp like they said, and I'm going to part it down the middle. And the parts really don't have to be really straight until you get to the front, so that's good. Is that straight? How about now? I think we should be good. So, first, I'm nervous. Let's do a little prayer. Amen. Okay. I believe that this is going to be really cute. So first, I split it down the middle. My hair feels really soft right now. So now I'm going to separate it in fours and we're gonna start with the back first. super heavy so I should I go with the curling cream or should I go in with the eco style gel I don't know okay how about we split it in half and we'll practice on one hey y'all this is me you know future me editing and um, y'all gonna see a lot of trials in this video, just letting y'all know this is how, you know, it really goes down when you're trying to do your own hair. Also, I took really big pieces. If you can see, my hair is small now, like the way skinnier now. But I took really big pieces. Y'all will see the finished product of this at the end, end, end. So stay tuned. Keep that in mind. So yeah, I took really big pieces. This was like a very much trial and error, but um, yeah, <laughs> I don't know. Y'all go see. So, yeah, keep that in mind. Maybe I should go with the gel first. Because styling gel. Yeah, I think I'm gonna go with the
Okay, y'all, so. <laughs> this is dumb. I mean, this is what it was looking like when they did it. So, what do y'all think? I'm so nervous. I hope that this turns out cute. But I'm gonna do it like that. Grab all the hair with Eco Styling Gel and then go in with this cream and make sure to curl my ends because I want it to be fluffy and, you know, cute. Okay, okay, I can do it. So I'm about to finish, like, I'm about to do the whole back of my head. Okay, so this is one I just did. You see how long it is? And then this is how long that one is, but it's like, you know, curling up. What does it look like in the back? Like, does it look like I got it done like eight months ago? Like, am I gripping enough? No fighting. Stick around. I'm so nervous. I'm about to do my whole head like this. Oh my gosh, what is wrong with me? Okay, so I'm gonna finish the whole back. Um, and then I come back and we're gonna see what it looks like. Okay, so we're completely done with this back side. I'm gonna turn around and y'all tell me what it looks like. Hold on. Because I don't know what it looks like, but from the front, it looks like how it's supposed to look. So, yeah. I had to cut some pieces of my hair because like they were like weirdly straight. I'm about to do this other side and then the back will be completed. Okay guys, so I'm halfway done with this side. Looking a little good. And then it dried up. So it's looking like this on this side. But like they are pretty bouncy. That's good. Cause I was scared there was gonna be bonus. The finished product is gonna be like this. Am I nervous? Yes. Baby, you can give us something. Baby, I can run all the time. Baby, I'm talking crazy. I need you right in my space. But I need it, baby, I'm late. But I still can check in with you. officially done with this side this is the last side and i can already tell it's really short it shrunk so much but it's bouncy and juicy so that's good i'm gonna still put mousse on it and see you know you gotta really see what it looks like when it's dry dry like this side over here so i just finished twisting all of my hair and, and I look like a little boy, but I'm tired. So I'm gonna let it dry, but tomorrow I'm gonna do the styles and try to make it cute. Cause right now, I don't know. But this is what it's looking like. I'm gonna do a 360. And then tomorrow when I wake up, I'll do the styles. So what I do, all I think about is you. Okay, I'm gonna wrap my hair, gonna I'm gonna go to bed and I will see you guys tomorrow.
Okay, so I end up getting my hair redone with the twist and they're way smaller but like way neater because I actually wanted to see if I like the style so like if you see some videos of me with how it was before it doesn't look like that anymore it's like way short I mean way smaller but like neat parts because I actually wanted to try it out and it's way fuller I would say you could do it yourself and like sit there and do it really small but like it takes real patience. I, mine was kind of big, they're kind of all over the place. So if you really want it, I would say just go and get it done. I'm gonna show you guys the finished product. So I guess I'm adding this at the end of my video, a little update. So guys, this is the finished product. Um, let's get a little up close. So you can see it's way fuller. They're way smaller too. I had it straight down the middle, but like, I kind of think that makes me look like a little boy. Let me show you the back. I'm actually really happy <clears throat> because I just need something that I can put my hair in that I can wear that's cute. But also because I have to do a lot of wig videos and stuff like that. Instead of taking down my hair that I spent money on to do a wig. But I need the money for that too. So I do the wig, and then after the wig, because I'm allergic to glue, my hair ain't done. Then I go and get my hair done, and the process starts. This, I can just put a wig on top because it's so flat, and it's like my hair. Well, it is my hair, but you know what I mean. But yeah, I can do like styles. So I'm gonna be rocking these. Like I look, like I'm not dressed right now, so when I do get dressed, it'll be cute. I feel it. Yeah, it took a long time, but like, they're super full. The curls are popping because my hair is so much healthier after I cut it. I just want to give you guys an update so I didn't leave you guys on the what I did on my hair. You, get, you can see what it looks like if you do it smaller and more professional looking. Like, hold on, let me show you my parts. Like, my parts are way straighter. So yeah, like I was just doing my stuff at like three in the morning and I was just tired. And I'm happy I'm actually doing stuff with my natural hair because I never thought I would. I just, you know, lay my edges down a little bit because they look natural. The parts just look so much more cleaner. So, yeah. Styles are gonna be cute. Yeah. Okay, so I added a little middle one just to make it cute. But me, I'm a side part girly, so may have it to the side a little bit. Or actually the side. It's just so pretty and like oh I'm gonna get dressed and you know to my eyebrows a little bit and I'm just gonna look so clean and chic and my little earrings I'm just gonna like I'm about to eat it up see one thing about me I'm not afraid to try something new you guys always see me with the 30 inch bust down you know wig long braids I'm gonna switch it up I'm gonna switch it up I'm about to be 20 years old old not old but you know I need to I need to experience everything. So comment down below what you guys think. Cause I really want to know. Like, can y'all see me with this? And remember, I'm not dressed. Like, I'm still in my pajamas. Like, don't do too much. Okay. But I really want to know. Like, what you guys think? Cause this is different. This is really different. Like, but even if y'all don't like it, I'm gonna try. I'm gonna see if I like it. I just want to know. Like, what you guys think? Cause we're your family now. Like. We're family now, so yeah. I tried to be, he begged me to stay. Hey, I'm not staying, I just wanna play. And the party, he just wanna run. Big boobs